my wrist. Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. It's been so long since I have done my boxes. And so we're coming up to the last three, April, May, and June. And I really have to kind of record these facts because I am moving into my apartment soon. And, you know, I, I, all my stuff is here at my house. So I can't record there and bring all this stuff with me. So I'm going to, like, record these in the next couple days. And hopefully you guys will see this. And by the next time I'm done finishing all three of those, I will be filming in a new location. So then, um, you'll get a better scenery. And I'm probably going to be, for the most part, recording, like, in the late evening or the morning or whatever. I'm not, I'm, like, not 100% sure yet. But when I do, you know, you guys will see, obviously. And, you know, that'll be that. So we'll be doing the April 2016 box. Now, as you can see from the past ones that they had, this is actually a lot, like, smaller, more boxier looking, not like a rectangle. And I actually like that about the new ones. And so, um, but I like the old ones too, so I like them both. So that's what we're going to be doing today. And, um, minus these. Now this has kind of turned into a situation with that item. And I will explain why when we get to that. So, that's just first thing that they have on here is the Chrissy Teigen's Cravings book. I have actually um, done some recipes in here. When I say recipes, I literally mean just one recipe. Because I did a recipe for my boyfriend's in my year anniversary day. So I made the, it's this rice, it's this coconut rice one. Here it is. There's, I don't think there's a, no, there's not a picture of the recipe. But that is what I did, the sweet and salty coconut rice. Because he loves coconut, so that's what I did. But this is basically what the book looks like. And I'm actually really surprised that they gave this because this is actually such a really nice like cookbook, to be honest. And it's hardcover. But, you know, I really enjoy this. I, mean, I might cook from this. I'm not like 100% sure um, if I'll cook all the recipes. Because I am trying to eat a little bit more healthier this year. You know, trying to look cute. Moving on is the Canvas Home Tinware Salt and Pepper Shakers. So when I first got these, I was like, oh my gosh, they're already broken. They're like already like messed up. And I was really upset. But then I realized that, that that's actually how the style is. So... This is what it looks like. This is the salt one, and this is the Ooh. this is the pepper one. <laughs> and um, so this is basically what they look. So I don't break these. I'm gonna just put one down and just do one of them. So see how it had this? I thought that already it had already been like broken and, and like and been ruined. And then I realized that it was actually on the other one too. So I was like, oh, that's just probably how the style is. But I really, really like that. And so this actually kind of saves me for the future for ever getting like a salt and pepper shaker. Because I think these are so cute, so simple. And yet they're just so adorable. And I just love them to death. And, um, you know, I'm really excited to use these one day. Everything is going to be down in the description below. So you don't have to worry about it. It saves me. From also in case I forget to you know say the prices and everything that's always gonna be down there I promise you so that retails for $12 and you can get that at canvashomestore.com and then the next thing is next by nature dark chocolate covered espresso beans okay so here's the situation I never got to try them so I had them around my house the longest time they were always in front of my like where I eat in the kitchen in the mornings and whatever and they were always there and then I moved them in the living room they were always there and then all of a sudden they just disappeared so I actually never got a chance to even like eat them got to see what they tasted like so that's my fault and I blame myself so so hard for that so I can't really give you guys a review on that product because I lost it 
but I will have the price and the where to get it down below. So if you guys want to try just getting it, I guess, if you really, really want to try it, retailed for $3.99 and you can get that at nextchocolates.com. The next thing is Pharmacy Sleep Tight Firming Night Balm. This is what it looks like. And um, it's a sleep tightening cream, I guess. So this is what it says. After applying the lightweight balm before bedtime, it transforms into a gentle oil gel to replenish your skin overnight. Firming, protective, and nourishing ingredients work to balance skin and prevent the appearance of wrinkles. So I've never worn this. So I'm waiting again. I wait. I'm waiting to do it with you guys. So without further ado, I guess we should just get into it. I really like the packaging that it comes in. I just, I don't know, I think it's very like zen. I don't know. That's just how I think of it. But, you know, I don't know. So it does have one of those protection things over it. Ah! Oh! So that's what the gel looks like. Kind of scared me because it, I was like, I don't know what that is. I'll just take some from the, from the top. So that's what the gel looks like, basically. Kind of like apply it on my skin, I guess, over Ah, I don't know. It's like oil. Ooh, it's so nice. My skin feels so tingly. From what I heard about when you use this, um, I actually got this tip from Beauty Bird is don't forget to do, like, the back of these things here because apparently when you put your hand in a ponytail they won't go up. Which to me I don't really care about but yeah I'm doing it. I put it on, you also want me to put it on. But that looks she looks like a lot. And um, you know hopefully if I can do a review about it and I tell you how it works, that would be amazing. But it feels really really nice so far. And I will probably do a full review on this. I'll probably do this back of cards because this feels so nice on the skin because it's just it's like it's like a nice oily like not too oily where it's just like oh like ew, like you can't whatever but it's just it's a, it's a really nice oily finish this is a little bit pricey it's forty eight dollars and you can get that at pharmacybeauty.com and pharmacy is spelled with an F just to let you guys know okay number five is the new design shop lemon flower sack tea towel. This is the tea towel and I read the description. It says, handmade in the US, this super soft towel isn't just cheery to look at, it's cotton fabric, gets better with every wash. Don't be afraid to use this beauty around the kitchen. You can throw it in the washer and dryer anytime. It just has a bunch of lemons on it. Um, my parents already used this, they just put it on bread and then that's it and they just kept that warm but it feels super like... I don't know, it's soft, but not like the soft, like, oh, like, cuddly soft. But it's just soft enough, and, you know, it's, it's nice. That retails for $18, and you can get that at MoonDesignShop.com. I don't know, what's up with my nose? I keep touching it, and it's just, like, annoying. Number six is the Royal Apathotic Field Poppy Conversations Hand Cream. Before I show that, this number... The last thing, this thing, I won't be showing because they're cards and I don't have them anymore. So, um, I'm just not going to do that because I don't have it anymore. This is the hand cream. It actually came in one of the nicest boxes I've ever seen. And I actually was never going to throw it out because I thought it was so, so, so pretty. But then I was like, eh, I don't need it. But I wish I had kept it so I could have shown you guys. But this is basically what it looks like. It's very, very cute. I feel so royal because it has like that little royal thing up there. I've never used this. And before I threw the box out, I was like, let me just check it. Because I was like, how in the world do you even like open this thing? So I went to go check and thank God I went to go check before I threw this box out. Because it actually comes with this thing that you're supposed to, hold on, like you're supposed to open the box with. There. That's basically what it looks like. So we're going to do this together. Cap is off. It is sealed. I'm gonna use the rest of the thing here a little bit. Okay. So 
so that is what it looks like. smells like I'm wearing perfume and it's hand lotion like it smells like I'm wearing like a really high-end perfume I love that my hands are super soft like wow they're like so soft amazing wow okay um I love this <laughs> I love this thing so far I think it's like so good it smells oh, so amazing and it goes in your hand so nicely the only negative thing I would have to say is that it does feel really kind of oily like more oily than what I put on my face but I love this thing I think it's amazing I highly now recommend people going out and getting this product it is like oh, it's amazing and so the retail price on this was $24 and you can get that at royalapathic.com so that is the end of my um waxing thing whatever you want to call it i hope you guys enjoyed the video if you liked it give me a thumbs up and if you're new to my channel if you don't mind subscribing i would love that very very much so you know i am probably going to be recording two more videos tonight you'll probably see me in this shirt again to be honest i feel like you've seen me in like my shirts all the time because i've recorded like the same night or because i don't feel like changing into looking like a normal person because i have to record at night because i just like it and i feel better recording at night i don't know that's just me that i will see you later bye guys